I started to tape up my chair because I'm going to be spray painting all of the wood on this gold. But before I did that, I figured I'd just do a quick video and show what it looks like before. So here is the chair before. This is from World Market, in case you are wondering. And so here is the whole chair and you can see that I've already started taping. This is painter's tape and I've just lined it so that all the fabric is covered and you can see like I'm gonna have to do right here and cover all of that up and the bottom I don't believe I'll need to do. Whoops! <laughs> um, yeah, that I'm not really too worried about getting any paint on but basically just covering up all the edges so that I can get all the wood and not fabric. I have now finished putting on all the tape where the wood meets the fabric. Here I used shipping tape because it sticks better to the fabric. When I was using the painter's tape along here, it worked really well and I think because it's a straight line, um, as far as it's sticking, it wasn't a problem. But when it came to up here, the painter's tape wasn't sticking, so I went with shipping tape so that it would stick to the fabric and stay on. So I have all the tape on. And right here, this is a little preview of what I'm going to be doing to um, the front of the chair right here and where the part where you sit. So it's just taking saran wrap and putting it along the biggest part of the uh, fabric and then just taping it to the tape that you've already done like on the edges. I'm gonna do that to this part and this part the last shot of the chair right before I spray paint it. I've spray painted everything and I think I've covered most of it, but it's kind of hard to tell because it's nighttime so the gold reflects. But as you could see before, inside like the etchings, there's white. So I can't tell if it's reflections or if it's white in it. Like in all the little crevices and stuff, but I think it's mostly covered. It looks super pretty right here. I just hope that none of the paint seeps down like into the fabric like under the saran wrap so now we have the chair fully spray painted and i did do one coat but i did kind of a heavy coat and then i um went back over just to make sure that i didn't skip any spots like near the bottom of the um legs of the chair so now i'm gonna take off the tape and I'm a little bit nervous to be honest, but okay, let's do it. Oh, wow. I impressed myself. I feel like Bob Ross. I was gonna say, it's like the ending <laughs> of his paintings. Yeah. Let's take off the edges. Wow, it really protected it way better than I thought. Okay. That's why they use it. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that looks so good. Now I just have to do the back, this part. Cool. That looks so cool. So just to close out the video, here's the finished product of the chair. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that this was helpful to somebody, and if not, then at least it's interesting because it's cool. I almost have like my own throne. So yeah, it looks really good, I like to think. And I will see you in another video. Bye!